hello and welcome to this new video on comparison between Arduino and the Raspberry Pi. So in this video I am going to discuss about the key differences between the Arduino Uno and the Raspberry Pi 4. So there are several, several versions of Arduino and there are several versions of Raspberry Pi as well. Okay, so like we have Arduino Uno, Arduino Omega and so on. Similarly, we have Raspberry Pi 2, Pi 3 and the latest version of Raspberry Pi 4. So I'm going to compare Arduino Uno with the Raspberry Pi 4. So what are the key differences between the Arduino Uno, how to program it and what are the tools used and what are the key differences and the applications of Arduino and the Raspberry Pi. Okay, let's get started with the basic difference between the Arduino and the Raspberry. So this is the Arduino Uno, okay, and this is the Raspberry Pi 4, okay. So Arduino is a development board, whereas Raspberry Pi, it is a mini computer, like you have, might have used the computers. So Raspberry Pi is also like a computer. Okay, whereas Arduino Uno is a development board where you can use Arduino Uno to develop embedded applications. Okay, so whereas Raspberry Pi is a general computer, the way you use the computer x86 processor, similar way Raspberry Pi is a mini computer. Okay, so the next key difference is Arduino Uno has a a controller or you can say microcontroller inside that is at mega 328p okay whereas raspberry pi makes use of arm controller or arm processor okay so Arduino uno is 8-bit microcontroller okay that is at mega 328p is 8-bit microcontroller whereas ARM which Raspberry Pi uses is of 64-bit so Arduino has 14 digital input output pins okay so you can configure these pins as input or output so it has got 14 pins like from 0 to pin number 0 to pin number 13 whereas Raspberry Pi has got 40 GPIO pins okay general input output so here also you can configure them as input or output okay so another major difference between the Arduino Uno and the Raspberry Pi is the analog pins whereas Arduino has a six analog pins to which you can connect analog sensors and implement your embedded applications very easily whereas Raspberry Pi doesn't have analog pins Okay, so if at all you want to connect any analog sensors, then you have to interface it to the ADC. So you externally you need an ADC board. Okay, Raspberry Pi doesn't have analog pins. So that is one of the key difference between the Arduino Uno and the Raspberry Pi. Okay, so Arduino doesn't require operating system that is real-time operating system okay whereas raspberry pi makes use of raspian os just like your computer which requires the operating system so raspberry also requires an operating system basically the raspian os is used for raspberry pi boards okay so Arduino has on board 5 volts and 3.3 volts pin outputs so you can connect your sensors or actuators and use them in your projects similarly raspberry pi also has got 5 volt and 3.3 volt pins on board as well okay so Arduino has no on board bluetooth module but if you want you can connect an add-on board to the raspberry pi and implement any Bluetooth related applications.
where a Raspberry Pi 4 has got onboard Bluetooth module. So easily you can implement IoT applications using Raspberry Pi 4. Arduino doesn't have even the Wi-Fi module on board, whereas Raspberry Pi 4 has got a Wi-Fi module on board. Okay, so with Arduino Uno, if you at all you want to connect with the internet, then you have to go for an additional Wi-Fi module. Okay, so you have to externally interface and Wi-Fi module to the uh, Arduino board. Arduino doesn't have USB port, whereas Raspberry Pi has got four USB ports. So it's just like a computer; you can just plug in the monitor, uh, so you can plug in the keyboard or the the mouse or any USB devices. You can connect to these USB ports. But Arduino doesn't have USB port, but it has got a USB to serial port mm, through which you can program the Arduino. Arduino doesn't have Ethernet port on board, whereas Raspberry Pi 4 has got an Ethernet port on board. Arduino can provide onboard storage, okay, whereas Raspberry Pi don't have onboard storage. What I mean to say is it has got an additional SD card slot wherein you will load the operating system onto the SD card and, and use the Raspberry Pi as a computer. Whereas Arduino doesn't require uh, any additional SD card, okay? So Arduino requires a host machine to program. Okay. So if you want to program the Arduino board, you need to have a host machine through which you have to program the Arduino. Okay, so there will be an Arduino IDE through which you can program the Arduino. Whereas Raspberry Pi doesn't require any host machine because it is a computer by itself. So once you load the operating system, you can use the Raspberry Pi and you can easily program it. Arduino makes use of uh, Arduino programming or it also makes use of C and C++ to program it. Okay, so whereas Raspberry Pi, uh, you can program it using uh, Python, or you can also use C and C++. So Arduino, can, Arduino pins can drive a maximum of 40 milliamps of current. Okay, so individual I/O pins in Arduino can drive 40 milliamps. Whereas Raspberry Pi GPIO pins can each pin drive a maximum of 16 milliamps of current. So Arduino consumes less power than the Raspberry. Okay, approximately it is 50 milliamps. Uh, Raspberry Pi is 700 plus milliamps. As I told you earlier, Arduino has got onboard storage. So it has got 2 KB of SRAM. Whereas Raspberry Pi 4 has got uh, uh, a, a RAM of 1 GB to 8 GB so different uh, versions are available so you can can have 1 GB of Raspberry Pi 4 to 8 GB of RAM for the Raspberry Pi 4 so Arduino is clocked at 16 megahertz okay so it is clocked using the crystal oscillator whereas Pi 4 can run at 1.5 gigahertz okay so it is clocked at 1.5 gigahertz it has got a quad core processor. Arduino is a low cost hardware, whereas Pi costs little higher than Arduino Uno. Okay, even we have a Raspberry Pi Zero, so which is less less costlier than the Raspberry Pi Four. So Arduino doesn't have camera port, whereas Raspberry Pi has got a dedicated camera port, so you can easily interface a camera to the Raspberry Pi board. So it doesn't Raspberry uh, Arduino doesn't have a HDMI port, whereas Raspberry Pi 4 has got an HDMI interface. So some of the use cases of Arduino and Raspberry. So what 
for what application you can use raspberry and for what application you can use arduino so in general where you want to run a particular application in a repetitive uh, way then you can go for arduino especially for embedded applications arduino is preferred so when you want to interface sensors and actuators so you can go for arduino uno okay so but when you want to have some machine learning algorithm or, or computer vision applications then it's better to go for raspberry pi so when you want to have an add-ons and third-party sub then you can go for raspberry so so for building simple projects and electronic circuits you can go for arduino uno so if you want to learn uh, coding and then you can go for a raspberry pi and use it as a computer okay so for general computer personal computer and educational use you can go for raspberry pi board so that's it from my side i hope you got my point so in this video i listed about the arduino uno and the raspberry pi 4 and what are the applications and use cases of raspberry pi and arduino i have discussed the key differences between the arduino uno and raspberry pi 4 i have discussed so thank you so much for watching this video in the next video i will come up with the a different version of Raspberry Pi and the different versions of Arduino Uno and we'll have a comparison. Thanks so much for watching this video.